Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm back with another YouTube series about WebRTC. But this time it's not only a simple video call application, it's a video conference application. In this course, we will learn how to create our signaling server using Node.js and JavaScript. And then we will learn how to design our UI using Jetpack Compose. After that, we will learn how to integrate our Android application with our signaling server. So we are ready to start the video call process. So let me explain a little bit about our scenario at the moment. On our signaling server, we have two arrays of rooms and the users. So whenever a user logs in, we are going to store his username inside our users. And then whenever the user tries to create a room, we will put his room inside our room array. So the user is inside the chat room and ready to others to join. And if somebody joins the room, we will send the signals that, hey, there's a new guy coming in and we have to start a new session with him. So we send a new session to the owners and other guys inside the room and we start to create a new peer connection for each user and try to establish a connection between all of the users. For example, if we have four users at the moment inside the chat room, each user would have three peer connection for each other users. So if we have four users inside the chat room, they should have three peer connections connected to the other users inside the chat room. Before getting confused, let's dive to the code and see what do we have inside our code. So I have opened the application inside my cell phone and the emulator. So let's create a chat room using my cell phone with the name one. And hey, that's me. Let's join it with our emulator. And you can see, you the, can call see the call connected. is connected. So we are so inside, we are the, inside conference. the conference. And if I, leave, if I leave with my, with my cell phone, we will see we go back to the room list. And on the emulators, we will have only one client. And if we connect back with our cell phone, we should be able to join, join the, conference the conference again. again. So let's not waste any time and dive to the code. Till the next video, see you everyone.